There is no such thing as perfection in technology, especially when it comes to police and body cameras. The view isn't uh, what the officer sees, but what the camera is positioned at. And residents in Cass County had a lot to say about it. Our Haiti Clotter has more on the story. At a public meeting to address police and body cameras, you would expect to hear from residents, but no one showed up. Policy 450 addresses the use of personal body cameras on police officers while on duty. Um, I believe now uh, the sheriff will uh, be implementing the policy. Uh, he didn't indicate to us that there would be any changes. Um, we don't have any changes to recommend to him. The cameras can be used as evidence in court and also offer protection to the officer. It creates an accurate event of what's going on as well as um, it allows us to review some of these instances where there could have been a complaint or something or um, we need to address training with officers. Sheriff Birch also says there hasn't been any negative feedback from the community about the body cameras because it doesn't affect them. They're really used as a tool for the police. It all starts with community involvement, community trust. That's one of the reasons we sought input from the community on the policy. Brenda Smith has lived in Cass County all of her life, and although she says she doesn't have the best relationship with the police, she believes the cameras are a good thing. There's a lot of violence going on these days, so I think it would be best. I, I think it's good. Sheriff Birch says the main issue with the cameras is the equipment failure, which can and has occurred. But residents like Wesley Brooks appreciate the job these officers have. People who are willing to put themselves in harm's way so that I can live a safe and secure life without being afraid for my security. Officers are encouraged to be a part of the community. We need the help on the eyes and ears from our folks that live in our communities to help us do our job. Sheriff Birch also says the department is transparent and is willing to let the public see what's happening as long as it doesn't jeopardize an investigation. In Cass County, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. Video captured by the cameras is available for the public once the investigation is closed. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.